Okay, let's unpack this. You're trying to stay informed, mm-hmm. re- get the key info without getting, well, totally overwhelmed. Yeah, information overload is real. Exactly. So this time we're zeroing in on artificial intelligence AI. And uh, not the futuristic stuff, but how it can actually genuinely help you get more done, simplify your life. Mm -hmm. We've looked into it, and our mission here is pretty simple. Pull out the practical ways AI can help you today, at work, at home, you know. Precisely. It's really about seeing AI less as like AJL 9000 and more as a practical assistant. Something that handles the tedious stuff. Yeah, boosts your own ability. Exactly. So let's start with automation. It's probably the easiest way to uh, get a handle on it. Think about a robot vacuum. Right. Simple example, takes a chore right off your plate. Exactly. It's AI doing a repetitive task. Now, scale that up. Imagine you run a small shop. Okay. AI could potentially manage your inventory, maybe even predict what you'll need, automate the reordering. So it's not just saving time. It's it's cutting down on potential mistakes, too. Yeah. And stress, probably. Right. Freeing you up for, you know, the bigger picture. That smart assistant side of things is, I think, where it really starts to click for people. And what's fascinating there, I think, is how it shifts your mental load. When AI takes over routine things, Mm -hmm. it's not just about getting it done faster. It frees up your brain power for, well, harder problems, creative stuff. That makes sense. It ties into efficiency too, doesn't it? Absolutely. Think about um, finding information. Remember old library card catalogs? Painstaking. Right. AI is like having this super fast searchable catalog for... Well, almost anything now. Okay. For businesses, that means, you know, faster answers for customers, better support. For you, it means getting the info you need, basically right when you need it. It just sorts through massive amounts of data so quickly. Okay, here's where it gets really interesting for me. How it helps with making decisions. Ah, yes. Decision support. Yeah, like having a friend who's, I don't know, incredibly wise and sees patterns you'd miss. That's a good analogy. AI crunches data, mm-hmm. identifies trends things that you and I might just glance over. It gives insights for smarter choices. Okay, give me an example. Well, take a restaurant. AI could analyze sales figures, pinpoint the most popular dishes. Right. Maybe even suggest menu tweaks based on what customers seem to like or what reduces food waste. It helps turn guesswork into like actual data-driven strategy. That's pretty concrete. And if we connect this to the bigger picture, Mm. you see this impact everywhere. Mm-hmm. In healthcare, for instance, mm. AI analyzing medical scans, potentially faster, sometimes more accurate diagnoses. Oh, wow. Or agriculture, mm. monitoring crops, optimizing water, fertilizer, getting better yields. And right, more sustainable too. Definitely. And then there's just our daily lives Siri, Alexa. Yeah, yeah the virtual assistants. They're not just toys, right? They yeah. help manage schedules, find info instantly, mm. handle lots of small tasks. Okay. And let's talk about uh, cost savings. That's always a big one. Yeah, very tangible benefit. (gasps) By automating tasks, streamlining workflows, AI can directly cut down on the resources needed. Fewer working hours spent on grunt work, maybe? Exactly. For a business, that could mean lower costs, higher productivity. Mm -hmm. For you personally, maybe it just means managing your time better. Right. Freeing up hours for, well, whatever you want. Hobbies, family, maybe even a side hustle. Precisely. So what does this all boil down to for you listening right now? I think the key is... AI isn't just for giant tech companies anymore. No, absolutely not. It's becoming much more accessible. Yeah, for students, parents, small business owners, Mm -hmm. everyone, really. There's real potential to simplify tasks, make smarter choices, and just, you know, get some time back. Which uh, raises an important question, doesn't it? As AI gets woven more deeply into our daily routines, how will that fundamentally reshape how we approach our work, our tasks, maybe even our long-term goals? That's definitely something to think about. Maybe just consider, you know, one area in your work or your life. Where could a little AI help make things, I don't know, smoother, more effective, maybe just less of a headache? Mm -hmm. The answers, the possibilities, they might be closer than you think. Mm -hmm.